Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. It's your friendly neighborhood, Ant Man 2939, here for those new daily Street Fighter 6 videos every single day at noon. We are really enjoying this new game, even though we're starting at the absolute bottom, both in terms of rank and skill. But we are starting first with Jamie, continuing our trek up with him, trying to see if we can learn what to do. And, uh, yeah. Of course, tonight we have 5 p.m. Central Dragon Ball Fighters, so if you want to see that, come back at 5. And we'll see if we can find our first opponent. Here comes a new challenger. Okay, one more kit. And it's totally the last match. This is a can I fought before. No. This isn't about just winning the match. Pride and bragging rights are at stake here. Both fighters will need to bring their A game to the table. Here we go. What are these fighters going to do? Jump in finds the mark. No good up high. Player two pushes the opponent into the corner. Hmm, what are they thinking here? The low heavy hits. Picks up some damage with a long reaching I can't help but notice his DP doesn't hit unless the very first part of the animation is. Let's see how things open up. They're jostling for the dominant position in the corner. Knockdown. Goes with the projectile to pressure the opponent. Throws out the fireball to check him. Denies the low hit. All right, what's coming up next? Surprises him with a drive rush. The quarter makes it hard to escape. What'll be the setup here? The jump in catches them. Hits them with a stop and bomb. Both fighters are barely alive. Good job blocking the jump in. Yo, put that away. Get them. Player one takes the round like a thief in the night. What else can they get away with? They piled up the knowledge. Now, how are they going to use it? Player two chases them down. Keeping them in the corner will only produce more damage opportunity. Blocks the low heavy. A quick breather. They may be planning to spend their drive gauge here. So he's trying to Both teach fighters me. will have to decide whether they want to go with an all-out offense powered by their drive or play it safe and conservative. Manages to block the jump in attack. Jumps in. Barely blocks the jump in. Super art on deck for both fighters. How they approach the situation will look to apply pressure here. Knockdown and can they create an opportunity for on for the critical art? This is our destiny. Shreds them with a critical art. Such a smart play to go for in this situation. Fighting back against the odds and giving them a chance to win this. Can they use their resources wisely to pick up the win here? They are not getting close to each other. Both of them back off. They may be preparing for the final exchange. Checking with the fireball. How will they react? They don't have any leeway to make a mistake. Someone's gotta make a move. What now? Lots of distance here. Who's baiting who? They back down to regroup. This may be the final push. Solid and light closes it out. Mm. I cannot stand how a 236 comes as, as a DP a lot. Because that's one of the better moves. Open, plus, plus, anti-air. Excellent read. It's time for both fighters to lay it all on the line. Medium kick hits. Oh, they're in the corner now. No running away. Chases them into the corner and will now look to do some damage. Low, heavy, but no go. Even fishing to get meter is risky in this game. And crowns them from above. This can lead to some big damage. This is gonna hurt. Medium kick. Back into the corner. What setup do they have? All the throw connects. Full stop. Nothing stops this train. Forward throw. Laying the pressure on thick. Somehow manages to block the jump in. The jump in is denied. Oh, oh, snipe! Player one can't let this simmer. He got drive and back misses. Fireball punish counter on reaction. Throws him. Oh, here we go. Keeps him out. No heavy. What will be the follow-up 
up here. Could they pick this son to fuck this out? This is our destiny. Yes. Perfect damage calculation. No doubt about it. Let's go. It is over. Player one is gonna be watching yeah, did it. <laughs> Oh, that's so goofy, though. They're still hungry. Both sides stepping up for the rematch. Sticks out a kick. This can lead to some big damage. You can open up chances to an opening and then jumping in. The cross up connects. Hmm, what are they thinking here? Jump in finds the mark. The low heavy hits. Low heavy hits. Mix up incoming. The low doesn't connect. Mm, All not... right, what's coming up next? Blocks the low heavy. So they break forward to pressure the opponent. Hey, oh. Player two takes the round like a thief in the night. What else can they get away with? They both showed their hands a little bit, so they must be thinking of a counter. Player one chases them down. Huge opportunity here with no way to backdash out of danger. Connects with medium kick. Side switch in the corner. Steals back a chance. Breaks the block with a throw. They decide to take a breather to regroup. Out of range. Relatively safe. Player two will look not to safe, apply not pressure safe. here. Going in? They are really going it's at each other. not safe. Rushes that off and keeps going. Good heads up decision on for the it. drive impact. Both fighters have a full this can lead to some big damage. Ooh, does them dirty. Drive them back misses. What are they gonna delivers the pain right to their doorstep? Feeling a real buzz. Somehow manages crowns them from above. Critical art is on deck. Sets up with the jump in. You cut that boy off. He's had this is close. Why is my DP not coming out? Player two gets the win in a convincing fashion. Dude, it seems like his DP kind of sucks. It has to hit him too low to the ground, which doesn't really help as a DP. Fighters are pumping themselves up and are raring to go. Who is going to come out on top in this fight? The top player is here. No mercy for you. Sheesh. So we'll play the story mode. So. The fight's now underway. This is vicious with the play-by-play. -play. Puts one in the pocket. Player one pushes the opponent into the corner. Buy some time by driving them into the corner. And now they can create some big chances to do damage here. The drink level's at four. All inhibitions are out the window. Coming through. Sees it coming and puts down to the wire. Really? Combo with the target combo. Good job blocking the jump in. They're showing us just how patient they can be. Player one chases them down. Heading into the end game now, it's getting tense. This is a huge chance to make a field. Knockdown. Moses with the throw. Hitting him with the smart stuff. Player two picks up the first round. That'll give them a psychological advantage. Oh, it looks like they're waiting to see what the opponent wants. Delivers the pain right to their doorstep. Got their eye on the air. Consistent anti-air is huge because shutting down the air game will let you dictate the pace of the match much easier. Player one has a slight life lead. 
Super Hearts on deck for both fighters. How they approach the situation will be interesting. Looking for a chance. Going in, experiencing burnout. Blocks. One chance here may end this match. KO! This is the final round. Expect to see some fireworks. Final round. Open with rushes down the opponent to impose their will. It's time for a drink. Both fighters are raring to go. They're waiting for the opportunity to bust this back wide open. Max SA gauges. Unbelievably in sync with a chance, rushes that off and keeps going. Knocked down and goes with the safe stuff with that amazing. That throw's gonna take off a chunk again. Ooh, you never know what can happen here. This chases him down. Crowns him from above. You cut that boy off. He's had too much. Dangerous range here. Totsugeki to the face. Can they use their drive to stay to come absolutely relentless? Noticeable life lead. Is the comeback still possible? What a sick counter. It's like they knew exactly what was going to happen. Sheesh. Player one is a force to be reckoned with. It's not over yet. Best believe it's time for that run back. Jumps. The throw missed. The jump in is denied. On dangerous turf. Easy to get tagged at this range. Both sides have full drive and plenty of health. Let's see how things open up. Player two pushes the opponent into the corner. Keeping them in the corner will only produce more damage opportunities. We have a lab rat. Well timed corner switch. That drive impact doesn't get through. Player two has used up all of their drive gauge. That drive impact is blocked. Blocked? But you so don't have any shit. So they break forward to pressure with this super arc connect. Adds a little yeah. super K. Oh. I thought if you didn't have any meter, Player you two couldn't two block my drive impact. First round. Bill wants to keep the ball rolling. Round two. Fight. Goes for the jump in to start. How will they take advantage of everything that's happened up until now? Player one got completely shut out that round. Can they make a comeback? Still very early in the round. Keeping track of the opponent's movements, waiting for a good opening. A little Drink bit of lag. Hits him with a stop and bomb. Uses the target combo with a fillip. Scrapping it out up close. Breaks the block with a throw. Both fighters planning something? Player two needs to use the threat of the corner here. They gotta be careful not to overextend or their opponent might go for a side slip. Player two rushes that off and keeps going. How will they manage their drive gauges? Attack, defend, anything can happen in this situation. Jumps in. Player one can't use any drive moves without burning out. Both of our combatants are cooking up something. Why was I not supposed to? Drink level four and now a full house to play with. Can they create an opportunity for themselves to seal the deal? Hanging, they're going for the super art? Looking to follow up after that party combo. Both sides getting ready. You've got to be mindful of reaching jump-ins at this range. A change of plan. Closes it out. A little surprised. Player two brings it home. Let's see if they can build up The multi-hit doesn't go through that. How is this rematch going to play out? Are we going to witness a blow up here? Timely side switch there, which will let them go on the attack. Well, they managed to escape the corner, but they can't let their guard down. All right. Both fighters have plenty mm. of health. Where is this match going to go? Mm, how are they going to deal damage? What's the oh, yeah, she's plus after a lot of stuff, isn't she? Here. Can they clip each other on the edge? She's not plus on knockdown, though. There's no chance. Will they build meter or just go all in on each other? I want to see how they manage their SA gauge here. Nails the timing and stings them. 
now they get pushed into the corner, where it's going to be very difficult to escape. Keeping them in the corner will only produce mm. more damage opportunities. Sure. Well timed corner switch. Knockdown. Can they convert this punish counter opportunity into something? In a dire situation, they can't afford any mistakes. The punish counter gives them a great opening. I think you have to hit three times in order to go through that. And I thought that was three, but advantage. guess not. Goes for the jump in to start. How will they take advantage of everything that's happened up until now? Big, low, reaching heavy. Uses a long range attack there to zone them perfectly. Delivers the pain right to the doorstep. Super on deck for both fighters. Expect to see some fireworks. Player two can't use any drive moves without burning out. Jump? You've got to be mindful of reaching jump ins at this range. What'll happen here? Player two will look to apply pressure here. They gotta be careful not to overextend or their opponent might go for a side switch. Barely blocks the jump in. Super hard on deck for both fighters. How they approach the situation will be interesting. This is where smart meter mm. management is going to come into play. Our fighters will need to tread carefully. Hits them with a stop and pop. Ends the meter, hoping for a good return. The Getsuga Saiho hit. We're about to see a freestyle frenzy with no retakes. What's next? Player one is on track to steal this back wall splat into the guard break. Player one needs to use the threat of the corner here. Tries to act quickly but with the attack. Can either of these fighters win without relying on this is gonna kill? No doubt about it. Well done. What a finish! Could have got it. But it to both of our fighters. They put on a real clinic for us. Cheers.